Governor John Bell Edwards and his team climbed off helicopters at the fairgrounds in Covington. They were still waiting word out of Washington on critical disaster declarations. Well, yesterday late, we asked for an additional 16 parishes to be included in the federal disaster declaration, uh, including St. Tammany Parish. Then, as Governor Edwards toured yet another area of the state that had been hit with unprecedented flooding, he got the call he'd been waiting for. And we got word as we were on a tour with President uh, Brister here uh, that that declaration had been expanded to include St. Tammany, which now opens the door for individual assistance to those individuals uh, who've suffered as a result of the flood. We've been waiting for it and hoping for it, and I can tell you there wasn't a better, better way to be, for it to be delivered than the governor telling us we were included. The inclusion allows the parish to begin getting some of the wheels in motion to help those impacted by the flooding over the last five days. I was just talking uh, with the FEMA uh, representative that's here now. Uh, we have already uh, found our spot to set up our, our centers one in the east and one in the west. We will open those up right away and we will start communicating that to them. So we'll, we'll start seeing it right away. The FEMA uh, administrator of uh, Fugate will be in Baton Rouge on Thursday. He and I will meet uh, together and uh, make sure that whatever assistance is available uh, as, as it relates to federal law will be available right here in St. Tammany and in 23 uh, parishes around the state now.